the U.S. economy is strong enough to handle a rate hike, according to Federal Reserve Chair Janet Yellen. In an FOMC policy statement and a press conference held after the U.S. Central Bank's policy meeting on Wednesday, Yellen said that economic activity has been expanding moderately, the labor market is improving, and there is confidence that inflation would rise. The statement and forecast keep the Fed on track to raise rates once or twice over its four remaining policy-setting meetings in 2015. I want to emphasize sometimes too much attention is placed on the timing of the first increase in the federal funds rate. And what should matter to market participants is the entire trajectory the entire expected trajectory of policy. And again, while our actual policy decisions will have to evolve in light of what really does happen in the economy, um, the committee, as you can see by the SEP projections, currently anticipates that uh, conditions will evolve in the economy in a manner that will make it appropriate to raise the federal funds rate gradually over time. The markets, which were tracking a bit lower before the statement, turned slightly positive while the 10-year Treasury yields fell a bit. Decision Economics, Kerry Leahy. But I'd still put the probability of them going in September at at 60 percent or higher. I still think it's going to end up being one of these decisions where the Fed's just going to have to close their eyes, hold their nose, and press the button. And right now, they're just not ready to press the button. In their projections, Fed officials lowered expectations for GDP growth in 2015 after accounting for a weak start to the year. It was the second time since December that the central bank has downgraded its GDP forecast for this year.